all right what up guys welcome back to a brand new video so today i'm gonna show you guys something a little bit different i'm gonna show you guys how to do this so that's a design or a method that i seen somebody do on youtube so i want to go ahead and see if i can demonstrate it to you guys maybe a little bit different doesn't matter so for that one i use yellow red white blue and a little bit of gold but then i changed my mind with the gold so i stopped on this one i'm going to be using i'm going to be using gold red white and i think that's it red white and gold all right so to start off what you're going to want to have is you're going to want to have some soap you need the the paint colors that you're going to use and one of the main things you need is a black spray paint try to use a, a matte black it just dries a little bit faster so just follow these steps i'm gonna go ahead and start so i'm starting with the gloss red Then I'm going to hit it with some of the gold. Actually, no. I'm going to leave the gold out. I might just use a yellow. That's going to look good. So the color for my car that I have, and I'll show you guys later, I have a mixture of red, a bronze, and the car is white itself. So this one's gonna go really good with it. And that should be good enough. So now, go ahead and get a little bit of soap. And the design I'm gonna do, I might do it just like that, like crisscross it. So, Cool, that should be good enough. So now just wait for it to dry just a little bit. You don't want to leave it too, too long. 
after probably give it about like give it like two to three minutes maybe four minutes at the most and then have your black ready because what you want to what you're going to want to do after that is you're going to want to hit it with the black everywhere like every single inch of it black everywhere and that's where it's gonna get that effect of the stripes so i think since it's hot out here yeah the paint dries pretty quick so it's ready for the black If you guys are going to be using spray cans, I recommend using the Krylons. This one I just had right there laying around. This is like a little cheapy one. I mean, I'm not hating on it or anything. Just saying the Krylons just spray a lot better. This one just you have to keep going. It's annoying. So make sure you get everything black. Black it all out. The good thing is that it's kind of hot out here, so everything's drying really quick. So I will be able to show you guys the end result. I wasn't going to show you guys because I wanted it to dry properly, but I think we should be actually good. Not gonna lie, it's looking pretty good already. I'm liking it. I was expecting it to look somewhat different, but no, it looks pretty good. If you guys want the process to go a little bit faster, I recommend doing it like how I'm doing it, do it in the sun. And hit it with that black as much as you can. You don't wanna see none of that color left behind because you're going to see it after you rinse it and like i mentioned before matte black is going to be the color that dries just more quicker the gloss black takes like twice the amount of time to dry so cool at the end after you get every single corner it should be looking like this It looks weird right now, but you will see. All right, so I see a couple of spots on this. All right, cool. That should be good enough. It should be dry right now, probably like less than a minute, two minutes. So right now, once I see these spots right here dry, take it over to the hose and when it's done it should look something like this which is amazing i love it i think i might do this valve cover like that got the 300 new transmission everything so this one's almost ready let's go ahead and take it to the water and careful holding it like this upside down because then the soap starts running and then you're not going to get the design that you want it's just that it's running right there already so it should be looking like this i just got that spot left to dry right there and that one and we should be ready
cool. Actually, that's good enough. You don't want the soap to completely, completely dry. So let's wet it. And this is a high pressure nozzle. That looks really, really nice. I should have made the designs just back and forth. I shouldn't have gone up and down, but still, it looks really good. All right, let's take it to the sun. Show you guys how it looks. That's the end result. Looks really, really, really nice. Comment down below, let me know what you like better, the Lexus one or the Infinity one. The Infinity one looks pretty nice. If anything, I might redo this Lexus one only because of what I told you. I should have went left and right instead of going up and down as well still it's really really nice but cool guys thank you for watching any questions anything like that go ahead and feel free to comment down below like share subscribe all that good stuff and i'll catch you guys in the next one